Alright, so I just completed a video where I showed you how to change cyber faces for men using uh, an easier tool than what I gave you the first time around. So what we're going to do is we're going to show you how to do the same thing for the female characters. First, you want to go into features, want to load up the roster, go to WNBA. I mean, you can do this inside of my league also. Um, or WNBA playoff mode, you can do this in there too. But wherever, just go to the mode that has the roster um, and then find, it works best if you find a person that doesn't have a real cyber face and only has a creative player face. Now, I know this person has a real picture, but she doesn't have a real cyber face. She actually has, um, this is a female creative player face. I just, I know because I'm just used to working with them, so I know this isn't a real face. All right, so as I showed in the last video, which you guys will probably need to go back to, um, you can go back to that last video, and if you, you can download from this link right here, that'll give you the cheat table that you need. So you need cheat engine and that cheat table. Now, we're not actually cheating the game out of anything, but we're using this. Now, if you see, while we're in edit player, these values will populate. When it says one for the CFID, that means it's a creative player face. So it does say one here. And what I want to do is I want to update this to a female face. So I've got some reference photos that I took. Um, so let's see. This is a female. We, we got to find a face that we want to use. All right. You know what? Let's use this one. This cyber face doesn't actually have any hair to go with it. At least not right now. Um, maybe they'll update it, but I'm going to use that one. All right, so that one, I just got, I double clicked right there where it said number one. And her cyber face ID is 9049. So I type that in, go back into the game. And if you make a change to like the height or weight, or if you come in this screen with shoes and gear, it should change should allow you to it'll refresh the cyber face All right so we're just going to add a headband to her since she doesn't have any hair the the female they don't have headbands they have these the ties they call them fury in the game so we add that to her all right looks much better so that's how you do that that's a real quick you know tutorial now we're going to switch her up to another one let me see Going to use a different ID just to go over this one more time. But if you've got it down packed, you don't need to worry about it. I don't know if it's down packed or down pat. Anyway, if you saw how to do it the first time uh, and you think you've got it, then it should be good. All right, so we're going to do this one. Now, if I right click here, I can change. I can go to change record. I click change address, but that was an accident. Uh, right click, go back up to change record. You can go to change the value. And then from there, you can change the value also. Or you could just double click it like I did the first time. I just wanted to show you guys different options. All right, 6565. So I'm just going to type in 6565 here. And then click somewhere in the table. All right, so, or you could just double click it. Anyway, press OK. Now we're going to go back to shoot. Um, we're going to go back to body and change the body just give it a second it should change the face all right so there you go just had to give it a second now that i have this cyber face applied i actually don't like this one because it doesn't match up with the arm color and there's nothing i can do about it because the the, the actual faces determine what the limbs and the legs and arm color is going to be so um I guess maybe if I put like a shirt on her or something. I'm coming in this screen just to see how she looks from far away. Still doesn't look good because the color of her skin doesn't match the color of her face, her arms and stuff. Maybe if, let's see. We took the headband off. Um, I'm looking for a shirt. Oh, you know what? Yeah. Uh, that doesn't look good. Maybe if I put long sleeve on her, it looks better, but her legs still look really light mm. anyway that's how you do this and i hope this was really helpful for you guys i mean the next thing you can do is you can just don't don't leave the video but you can rename 
you can rename them I've shown you guys this in a different video but some of you are new to my channel or some of you just may have missed that video so as you can see I'm changing her name you know I can change her school whatever I could change it to North Carolina but whatever all right do, do. now this is PC only I think most of you know that all right so once we save her she still has the old portrait so it's actually better if you do this on a player that doesn't have a portrait like if we come over here this is really supposed to be Indiana fever but I changed them to West Virginia but um, if you come over here like player like this that has no portrait it would have worked better if I did it on her but anyway Hopefully this video was helpful for you guys, just showing you how to change female cyber faces. Uh, this is only for PC. Go back and watch the original video that I did right before this. Um, Alright, you guys have a good one. I'm out.